Before the Panzer 68, the Swiss military relied on tanks such as the Panzer 61. While effective, these earlier models faced limitations in terms of firepower and protection, leading to the development of a more advanced main battle tank. The Panzer 68 was developed to address the growing need for a more capable and modern tank that could compete with the advancements seen in other nations' armored vehicles. Switzerland aimed to create a tank that could ensure the defense of its territory against potential threats. The development of the Panzer 68 involved extensive testing to ensure it met high performance and reliability standards. These tests included mobility trials in harsh terrains, live fire exercises, and durability assessments to refine its design and capabilities. The Panzer 68 boasts impressive specifications. Mass, 39 tons. Length, 9.49 meters, 31.1 feet. Width, 3.20 meters, 10.5 feet. Weapons, equipped with a 105 mm Royal Ordnance L7 cannon, a 7.5mm MG-51 coaxial machine gun, and a 7.5mm MG-51 anti-aircraft machine gun. Armor. Up to 80mm 3.1 enrolled homogeneous armor. Speed. Up to 55 km per hour 34 miles per hour. Range. 350 km 217 miles. These stats highlight the Panzer 68's balance of firepower, protection, and mobility. One significant advantage of the Panzer 68 is its robust firepower, provided by the 105mm L7 cannon, which was among the most powerful tank guns of its time, capable of engaging and destroying heavily armored targets. A unique feature of the Panzer 68 is its advanced hydropneumatic suspension system, which provides excellent mobility and stability over various terrains, enhancing its operational flexibility. The Panzer 68 operates with a crew of four, a commander, a gunner, a loader, and a driver. This traditional crew layout ensures effective operation and maintenance of the tank. One drawback of the Panzer 68 was its initial mechanical reliability issues, which were partly due to the ambitious technological advancements integrated into the tank. These issues required frequent maintenance and updates to ensure operational readiness. To address the initial mechanical issues, the Swiss Army implemented several upgrades and modifications to the Panzer 68 over its service life, improving its reliability and performance. These efforts ensured that the tank remained a formidable asset in Switzerland's defense arsenal. A total of 300 Panzer 68 tanks were produced, serving as the backbone of Switzerland's armored forces for several decades. The Panzer 68 stands as a testament to Swiss engineering and innovation in armored vehicle design. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more detailed insights into military technology.